In 1994, an earthquake with a magnitude of 6.7 struck Los Angeles, California. The Northridge earthquake cut off highways and destroyed more than 14,000 structures and houses. The financial loss was estimated to be more than $30 billion. This is Bel Air, California, an exclusive residential area in the western suburbs of Los Angeles. The damage of the Northridge earthquake was widespread and affected this affluent suburban area. Bel Air Presbyterian Church was no exception. The pipe organ, a symbol of the church, was severely damaged. Most of the pipes were salvaged, but the equipment that controlled the pipes and organ console was completely destroyed. People were stunned by the loss of the organ. The earthquake, considered to be an act of God, took away the pipe organ from the church. However, the people who loved the organ decided to take this opportunity to reconstruct it using a very new method. This is the Bel Air Presbyterian Church, which was affected by the Northridge earthquake. The latest digital technology has had a positive impact on the repair of their pipe organ. So we just took a, a fresh look at everything and wanted very much, however, to, to include the pipes in whatever we did, both from, a, from an aesthetic standpoint and from a sound standpoint. The organ could have been restored if they had replaced all the parts that were damaged by the earthquake. However, the congregation determined that they would not simply replace the organ, but instead install a newer, better, larger organ that meets the needs of a new era. After a heated debate, the congregation agreed that the sound had to surpass the tonal integrity of the traditional organ. The organ had to match the aesthetics of the church. They put their efforts in pursuit of new possibilities for the church and organ music. And we wanted something that, that if this church decided it wanted to go to more contemporary types of music, we wanted an instrument that could, could uh, add to that rather than be replaced by it. They reached a conclusion to repair the damaged pipes and to combine the pipes with high-quality digital voices. They also chose to add digital orchestral and sound effects. Now, the original console for the Casamet was over here where you see the white wall space. That was completely destroyed because the, not because of the earthquake, but because the sprinkler system came off and ruined all of the wooden action parts that are in here. We are looking at the four-manual Rogers console that was installed in the rebuild. Digital voices were newly added to the existing 48 stops, creating a grand total of 151 stops. The result is a broader, richer expression of organ sound. The congregation used pipes that were salvaged from the earthquake. For the new digital voices and sounds, New speaker systems were installed and carefully placed throughout the pipe chambers and the church sanctuary. We are now in uh, what used to be the swell organ. New parts were made for those that were totally destroyed, such as the box for swell pipes and the four manual organ console itself. The part that controls the sound of the pipes was replaced by a digital device. The piece that took up so much space in the past has now been replaced by a small digital part. But what really surprised and pleased the congregation most of all was the beauty of the final sound. Combining the pipe salvaged from the precious organ with digital technology, the timbre of the new organ has proved to be a pleasant surprise to the congregation. And it's, a, it's
It's an unbelievable combination of digital and pipe. I'm amazed. I thought that I would be able to tell. I've studied organ many years in my life, and I had not the vaguest idea what is digital and what is pipe. I cannot begin to tell the difference. It's a wonderful, wonderful instrument. And, uh, we began hearing organs yeah. that were hybrid organs and realized that we could have a much larger organ yeah. Yeah. with many more capabilities of sound. By doing this, it was a wonderful decision. The solemn resonance of the combination organ, born in Bel Air. The charm of the organ has remained strong through 2,000 years of history. It now has numerous possibilities which result from the integration of digital technology.